What's up and welcome back to the channel. Hope everyone is having a great weekend here. I know I am hanging out here in the Furiously Collecting headquarters. Um, actually really tired. I've been doing a ton of work still trying to get this place all set up and kind of get all moved in. And yeah, getting old, back is aching, uh, but it's all going to be worth it in the end. So Still really excited to show you guys kind of the finished product. Um, moving a little slow, but we are getting there. But I also am falling behind on my unboxing. So I've been sitting on this for a while. I picked up all of the most recent two packs here from, I think I got it from Wheel Collectors. So here you get a nice view of it. So very cool to have some more premium Bugattis as well as these Subaru WRXs. And then we got a pretty sweet little like JDM set there with the Nissan Sentra and the Nissan Silvia S13. So pretty excited to crack these open. The wheels on the Veyron there look pretty cool. I'm not sure how they look on the actual car, but we are going to find out. So we are going to be cracking into all of these and adding it to our loose collection. And since we are already talking about the Bugattis here, we might as well crack this open first. So this is the Bugatti Veyron and the Bugatti Chiron. So kind of two different models here. Let's see if these are going to be nice to us today, unboxing or not. Usually these like multi-packs usually open up pretty nice with no issues. Ooh, I think I saw some carbon fiber here on the Veyron. Let's check it out. Dang, those wheels in the back are huge. Wow, those are some meaty wheels. But yes, you can see here on the top, we have some carbon fiber details on there. Actually looks pretty cool. This thing does look pretty mean. Got some nice tampos there on the back. Man, look from the back here. Look at that meat setup back there. Man, freaking girthy. But overall, pretty cool. I really, I know a lot of people aren't a huge fan of the Bugatti cast, but I don't know. I definitely enjoy them. So I just think they definitely look pretty cool when you have them all set up. And once again, this one has the five spokes and this one looks really good too. So I think we saw this one in black and blue in the Hot Wheels Exotic Envy set, I think. I'll have to go through and get out all of my other Bugattis. But yeah, this one looking super good. So I'll get both of these up next to each other. Pretty menacing combo actually, pretty sweet. And we'll do a drastic change here from the hypercar Bugattis here to some JDM Super Street Nissans. So I think these, not a huge fan of these. I mean, the Nissan Silvia S13 is obviously pretty cool. Um, but yeah, any like kind of more like 90s styles car, uh, definitely really just like the that boxy like retro look to them. Here first we have the Nissan Silvia, the S13, I believe. Man, this thing looks super clean. And the five-spoke wheels are definitely some of my favorites. That and the six-spoke TE37s. And the details on this is actually really nice. This thing looks super, super clean. I like that color, kind of like a soft, like mint green with the gray two-tone. And this thing is actually really, really nice. Okay. Very, very cool. And we'll get into the next one here, which was the Sentra. Not too familiar with this car. Kind of looks like the old, like the, was it the Honda Accord or Honda Civic? Like kind of has that old same body style. So this actually has the small TE 37s, which fit it 
very well, almost in that like a nardo gray kind of color. Once again, the tampos and graphics on these are pretty nice. I know a lot of people were pretty hyped on this set. You got the Super Street sticker there on the window. Yeah, I know a lot of people were pretty excited about this one. I can definitely see why those two cars look very nice. And last up here in the middle, we have the Subaru STI pack. So, all right, I guess that on the left is just the Impreza. And then on the right is the STI with the World Rally blue and the yellow wheels. Is that, the other one basically looks like the 22B, a very similar cast. Let's crack these open here. I have quite the Subaru collection going to a lot of premiums and this looks good. I love the big bug eye headlights with the big roof scoop. See the intercooler there in the front. Yeah, I think from the front looks really good. I don't know if I like that wheel color. It's kind of like, like a mustardy yellow. I don't know. Kind of, kind of odd. Yeah, the back tampos. Yeah, this set, I feel like they did a very nice job with the tampo work and the paint and everything. It looks very nice. So big kudos there. Now let's get out the STI. So this is in like the classic STI, like World Rally livery here. Oh dang, it even has the roof scoop, the hood scoop. Got all the scoops. Got the big rally wing in the back. And yeah, a lot of pretty good tampo work here. Not bad at all. This was a very cool set of two packs, I would say. Um, I mean, I don't really think any of them were really a miss for me. I mean, Bugatti, old school JDM Nissans, some STIs. Yeah, I can't go wrong here. Very cool set. All right, let's get these on the diorama and get some B-roll footage. Folks, that is going to wrap it up here for today's quick little unboxing video. Like I said, trying to get caught up and I have so many cool cars to check out and just all the work here with the headquarters. Just been super busy and honestly just pretty tired, but still got to make time to unbox and make some of this content. So hopefully you all enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe, and we will catch you on the next video. Peace.